help of trigonometry okay now we have already studied about different types of triangles scalene triangles equilateral triangles and right angle triangles but whenever we'll be learning trigonometry you'll see that yeah we'll be focusing our entire discussion only on right angled triangles why we'll be learning that shortly okay now we are learning about right angle triangles and not any other types of triangles so why is it the case that yeah on the trigonometry we are going to study only about right angle triangles that is because any triangle yeah consider this triangle or this triangle you see these are not right angle triangles any triangle they can be broken down into right angle triangles okay yeah you see that yeah it can be broken down into right angle triangles and similarly this can also be broken down into right angle triangles now brush off this triangle why only triangles i mean why not the other types of polygons rectangles squares okay that is because if we consider any polygon say suppose this that can be break, broken down into a number of triangles and those triangles each in turn can be broken down into a number of what right angled triangles so basically be it a polygon or be it any other type of triangles the ultimate small structure that we obtain is the right angle triangle and that's the reason instead of going into the complex structures we refer to the simple right angle triangle because those big structures polygons and other types of triangles they can be broken down and reduced to a right angle triangle okay now this okay thus we see how this easy technique will help us to find out different parameters